Hello, we are live at the KFC Yum Center in Louisville, Kentucky. I'm just Perez. Yeah, you moody moose. Where today? Madrid and Elante will take on the Vampires of Walk. Not only in a handicap match, but it's also a street fight as well. In a street fight, there are no countouts, no disqualifications, and in goals. Not to mention, tags aren't necessary. That's right, tags are not necessary. But I won't count out Emmy just yet. She has a size and strength advantage. But don't forget the vampires at work have the have the number advantage as well. True, true. We don't know how to pronounce pronounce the names of the vampires are than the vampires at work, so let's see, how about this? How about we call that one head? Bad vampire, and we'll call the air one face paint vampire. Works for me. Here they are, their team name, the Vampires of Rock. Head bad vampire on your left, face paint on your right. No, you know, in the past, normally, no one with the You were going to say, you knew in the past, mostly the ones with the numbers advantage always win, right? Right. I mean, name one time, well, I'm sure there have been times where the man who had this number disadvantage won, but that's rare. It's usually the, num the man or the team that has the number advantage. The only time... I can recall when the team had the number disadvantage and still won was at Survivor Series 19, not, not 19, 2007 when Team Triple H defeated Team Omega. It was 4 against 5. But other than that, I can't think of anything else. Like, it's very rare where a man or a team had the number disadvantage and still win. Here we go! Oh, what a kick by, by Face Paint's Vampire! But E.M. Bronx is all. Meanwhile, Headband Vampire is on the outside. Probably waiting for his, probably buying her time to strike. I, no, with counters, kicks, kicks, punches, she blocks. He, she's going to sleep road, I can't believe it. No way that, she's lifting her as well, oh my goodness, you just see the, feel the power. See the power? Well, nice Billy Grimm event. Billy Grimm impression, Jesse. Well, you're welcome. And thank, I mean, thank you. <laughs> Are you this match is going off the rails for me, huh? <laughs> no, but. See, normally I don't. Oh my god, a back suplex! <laughs> but she still gets back right back up. Counters. Counters, oh my god. Oh my goodness. Kicks her down. And goes for the cut to hunt me. Oh my god. They're not letting go. Yeah, too bad for E. For M.E. This is a no DQ match. Yep. Or by show up letting go. Oh. M.E. tries to fight back. Counters. Oh, now she's in a sleeper now. And now it's. Head bam, vampires turn to do, do the sleeper. Go to sleep and good night. Here she goes. But she didn't submit. Doesn't matter, still going. Now she's got her uh, front face lock. Who would have known they know submission moves? Well, I knew. But I never thought they'd actually use them in this type of matchup. Where I can use tables, ladders, and chairs. Oh my. Now they're stomping on the knee of... But she gets right back up. Oh. Well here... Headband Vampire has got a sledgehammer. Oh my goodness. 
Here, let me be your sledgehammer, but... But this is ridiculous. Mortally, Hemi stops her. When I feel on... Oh my... Oh, down goes face pink vampire. She's gonna be a sharpshooter. A variation of a sharpshooter, that's for sure. Not the one we're familiar with. Unfortunately, she doesn't submit. Unfortunately for M.E. at least. Oh, what well, a spin kick by Face Paint Vampire. What M.E. needs to do is to fight and conquer. Get one out of the ring and keep one in the ring. That's what she needs to do to fight and conquer. Well, getting a weapon first will also help too in this type of matchup. Exactly. Strike jacket. Will she submit? I think at this point, the real question is, should she submit? Should she? Fa Smart move by the vampires or rock ball. They're not going to match muscle with muscle. They decide to match muscle with brains. Brains over brawn. That's very clever. The vampires are rock. Oh. But she gets right back. Wouldn't we? Oh, twist of rock! Twist of rock! One, two, three. No, no! No, she got up just in the nick of time! Oh, no. She's got the turbicle padding off. Oh, and a knee kick by my face paint. And we better be careful. Oh, clothesline! No, headband's got a chair. I guess you could call the chairman or the chairwoman of the team. The range of the vampire. The range of the vampire. Will she submit? No, she doesn't. Sore for stretch. She finally gave up. She had no choice. She was not only being outnumbered, but out-wrestled as well. I wouldn't blame her. Live to find our day. Very smart, smart though, of the vampires to use brains over brawn. Yup.